Welcome back, everybody. 70s to 9, Alpha 21. I'm an old guy gaming, and this is the Apocalypse Ranger series. Uh, in this episode, we are going to start uh, Tier 4 jobs for uh, Wrecked. So, let's see. We have a Tier 4 clear. Uh, Butcher Pete's, that should be a good one. And, uh, yeah, so let's see. I think I have a point. Yeah, we do have a point to spin here. Um, we are continuing to pump agility, so we got Gunslinger up. Why don't we... We got Hidden Strike up. Let's go with Deep Cuts next, I think. We are now a Samurai. All right, cool. Um, and let's see. We got some... Yeah, we got some food and drink with this. I need to actually go get some more um, Chrysanthemum, uh, but I will... I'll do that later. Um, it's a little... We're getting a little bit of a late start today because I had some stuff to do uh, when I got back from Ranger Station. Um, Ranger Station, whatever the Ranger Station is that I was just at because I can never seem to remember the name for some reason. Golf. <laughs> Ranger Station Golf. Uh, all right. So I'll see you guys over the job site. Um, actually, hold on. Did I... I have a bunch. I have a bunch of stuff to sell to wreck, but it all needs to be repaired, and I just don't have enough uh, glue and duct tape uh, for that. So I think we're just gonna hold off on that for now. Okay, we are at Butcher Pete's. I have um. I've wrenched uh, the cars around here for gas, but I don't think I've done anything else over here that door's locked yeah all right let's just get it started then so this is a clear all the stuff in here to loot man we have a sneak bonus damage of six that is awesome and yeah, quite a bit of stuff to loot in this front room okay so let's see got this good this basket too. Let's go up here. Um, is there there's something over here that we can do? Nope. Okay. I think I'm gonna go ahead and grab this. And let's grab this too, why not? We are using um, armor piercing rounds in our pistol. So I see three dots. But let's keep it as quiet as possible. Uh, I can't quite tell what I'm looking at there. Uh, uh, well, you know where his head is. I think he's, yeah, he's faced away from us with his feet pointing towards us. So let's see if we can get a better position here. We might be able to squeeze a headshot off here on our lane if we go right here. Okay. Let's grab this steel crossbow bolt before it disappears. I'll leave all that stuff. Right over here, and we got a nice headshot. It's a beautiful thing. All right, that takes care of all the Zeeks on this floor. All kinds of gross stuff going on in that table. Uh, 
Well, let's hit this. Yep, I'll take both of those things. Up we go. There is a dog kennel in there. Oh, that's kind of weird how it does that with the light and the shadow there. All right, let's give this door a full repair because I think we're gonna have some more fun coming out of this room. They don't have a good shot off on anybody here. Take those to sell. All right, there's the dog. And uh, yeah, that's the head of the dog. All right, well, that didn't go terrible. We, didn't, we actually didn't take any damage. It's just surprising. But hey, I'm not complaining. Okay, let's open up this safe, and we're going to pop these on real quick. Actually, let's just keep these on while we're in here. Yeah, no, I'll put the other ones on for the XP. I just got to remember to switch them. I know, that's that's a tall order for me. <laughs> but we can do it. We just got to just gotta do it. Oh, look at that. Of course. Of course. All right, is this one better than the one we made? It is... Wait, what? There's really that much difference? That does 65.2. This one does 83. Because the comparison doesn't... Do... Yeah, see, it doesn't include the mods. Wow, that is a huge difference between a bow you can find in loot and one you make yourself. Interesting. Okay, well, I guess that wasn't a waste that we made that. Yeah, that mannequin always freaks me out when I come up here. See two red dots that way. Okay, got a nurse, Nancy. Let's reload this. Steve can't really get to his head so he gets shot in the nuts all right that's it for up here there is a duffel bag it looks like in here sport uh, sports bag we'll take that Lots of real basic loot up here, but nothing super fantastic. All right, yep, all right, we got to go down, down into that shaft. Let's get this ready. Everybody loaded. Yep. What about a shoddy? Yep, shot he is too. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, so I think once we jump down here, I think we get attacked. But we can parkour back up here. Oh, okay. Can we parkour up here? Yes, we can. Look at that. <laughs> it's amazing. Love the parkour. All right. I see three dots. I think this is going to be a trigger situation. Maybe. We might be able to just... Nick Steve's head there. Well, if we're going to jump up here, we need to get... All right, screw it. Oh, is he... are you the only one that's awake? Not anymore. Shit. Yeah, I, I kept hitting the edge of that, trying to jump up there. <clears throat> Let's remove this. So then I can just... Well, alright. Let's do this then. Because we're, we're not done yet. I mean, there's going to be another big ambush coming up here. I still can't be right up against the wall, is the thing. Okay, well, that'll be fun in panic mode. Uh, let's see, we have an infection and an abrasion. Can't do anything about the infection until we get back to the bike, so we just have to make sure we're back uh, before it gets to 5%, which I think we can do. Yeah, as soon as we open that door, the shit's going to hit the fan. Okay, let's get rid of that. There's my crossbow bolt. Um, we're already full anyway, so we're gonna, let's just finish the quest and we'll just we're just going to have to come back down here for this stuff later. Okay, so here's the plan. I didn't bring any four bites with me, did I? So we're going to unload with the SMG on four, and then I'm going to hit five and unload with this, and then shotgun is our third fallback. And the pistol would be the fourth. All right, here goes nothing. Here they come. Yeah, see, that was a, a triggered event. Okay. Now, what we might be able to do here... If we could get him to come down close enough. Where are they going? They're like right behind this wall here. That works too. That can definitely work for us. Now they're trying to hit through over here. Will they come to this door? 
Ooh, that's 10,000 hit points. Okay, let's get back over here. If we put... If we put this down so they detect a, a pathway to us, will that get them to come back over here? where they're at. Okay. Okay, let's try this. Can we get it to... Oh, shit. I think that worked. We only have one left. Where you at, lady? Okay, quest is done. We have this thingy right here in the way. hitting that, but I was hitting the... <laughs> I can't hit this thing. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is terrible. Here, actually here, hit this. Damn. Okay. Let's get an antibiotic going here. Actually, drive this down here. And this also gives us a whole bunch of um, uh, gasoline and vehicles that we can wrench for gasoline. Oh, are there more Zeeks up here? I don't think so. Yeah, I think we got them all. Oh shit, we gotta get rid of some stuff. Okay, um, let's offload into the bike. I'm gonna throw those out because it's so easy to pick, it's ridiculous to carry them in our inventory. Uh, same thing with that, that's easy to get. That's too much paper to throw out, so we're not gonna do that. Cement is arguable. Uh, those bones are on the borderline too, but we'll keep them, I guess. Um, I don't, I, don't, I don't need paper. I've got so much paper, it's not even funny. Let's... Well, actually, we don't need that. We're good. We could go ahead and consume both of these, just to free up the spots. And hopefully that'll give us enough room for the loot. Well, we still have more room here, so let's put that in there, that in there. Uh those in there those and we'll put the coin in there okay that should definitely give us enough room okay let's go back into here first uh, there's a couple things up here i think yeah we got that and let's loop this Now, I heard that if you wrench one of these things, you get a blood bag. Yep, look at that. We got a blood bag. 
And some other stuff too. That's pretty cool. Very, very good to know. Okay, I think that's it for in here. We already looted those. Check the dumpster. More miso. I'll come back here and wrench these vehicles later for gasoline. I'm not going to do that right now. Probably end up throwing those rocks away. Okay, I'll wrench that later. So I think we're ready for the fat loots. Nice. We can now make herbal antibiotics. Nice little pile of ammo there. Look at all that stuff. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I'm going to big old damn fly in my office. He's bugging me. Let's try and kill him. All right, let's do the passing gas. Popping pills. It's disgusting in here. And I think we're ready for the fat loots. Aha, I got it on the first try. Okay, nice. We got another treasure map. Workstation book. Harvesting tool. Uh, we'll just read this now. Oh, this is good, too. Good loot, man. Good loot. Let's just read that. And it's not very far away, either. Uh, maybe we'll do that for the last part of the episode here for today. Um, you know what? Now that we're doing Tier 4s, I'm going to start carrying um, uh, eye candy with me now, too, because it'll be worth it for this higher-end loot. Let's go do the turn-in. All right. <laughs> You're not going to believe this, but that fly I was just talking about, he landed right on my left hand on the keyboard, like right here, and so I just took my thumb and went... <laughs> didn't even fly away. Uh, so I had to pause the game and go wash my hands because these flies are filthy. Oh, that was funny. Okay, anyway, let's uh, let's go do our turn in. Um, actually, here we got something in here we can loot. And does this place have a mailbox? I don't think it does. Okay. What you got, Ming? Oh, great, here you go. Another Don't level four in one place. military helmet. Grenades, grenades have been nice, but I can make those. We don't need the single pocket armor schematic, and we got a bunch of those. So, you know what I think I'm going to do? Well, I think I'm going to take the forged steel, because we need it for, for the horde base. So, yeah, let's do it. All right, now... You restock tomorrow. Have we already looked at your inventory? I can never remember. Yeah, I think we did because he's got that that green tack rifle there that he had before. And gun magazine. Okay. All right, let's sell. Oh, look at that. We're up to 20,000 coin and then some. That is a beautiful thing. Let's sell those and those. And I think we'll keep everything else that we currently have. Oh, you want a guarantee, huh? Well, maybe you should try Shamway. <laughs> okay, so we have some more quests here. There's a Listen fetch and clear. Jackass. You won't work? Then show some respect. All right, so this is at a fort. So we could kill two b birds with one stone. Um, you know, clear the fort and do the job at the same time. So I think we'll do that. And I don't, a deal. I don't think we've actually found and this fort camo yet. Wrong end of a rope. Uh, let's see. Show, show on map. Nope, we haven't even found that fort yet. Cool. All right, that'll be nice. But uh, what we're gonna do, what I'm gonna do, is. Yeah, I think I'm going to run back to the base real quick. 
just put a couple things in the drop chest and then let's go do this this treasure next so we'll make Sarah's treasure the active quest and it's not very far away at all so I'll just meet you over at the treasure location all right here we are at the dig site uh, I grabbed an eye candy and I also put uh, that armor plating on here I had a the custom fittings that help us move a little quick uh, quickly more quickly I took those off because we don't really have any problems with movement and put that on there okay so let's get to digging here and uncover this treasure And there it is. Okay. Let's pop this eye candy. We already have our lucky looters on. And see what we get. Okay. Um, not bad, actually. Not bad at all. Alright, let's patch this hole up. So we don't fall into it at a later point in time. That would be no fun. Very good. So, um, what time is it? 15.39. Why don't we, before I let you guys go, why don't we run over to Trader Bob? We need to go there anyways for opening trade routes and just see what he has in stock. So I'm gonna stop off back to the base again and grab my awesome sauce and cheesecake, pumpkin cheesecake. We already have the cigar. And uh, we'll run over there real quick and just see what he has. Hey, Bob. Do, 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 do. Now we're cooking with gas. Okay, so we got uh, opening trade routes done. Let's take a look at his inventory. He's got the dirt bike chassis. Oh, he's got an impact driver. Not a really good one, but that's still probably better than our purple wrench. No, it's not, actually. Yes, it is. By a fair amount. <clears throat> the block damage is really the only thing that matters. Um, that's got 53 more block damage. Okay, what else you got? Hunter, spear hunter, water filter... Got another cement mixer. I wish if he had a crucible, that's what we would get. He had one a couple cycles ago, but I didn't, wasn't even anywhere near have, having enough money for it. Nope, he doesn't. <clears throat> okay. Well, let's sell this to him. I'm not going to consume these things. Um, We could... Could buy the dirt bike chassis, but what else do we need for the dirt bike? I thank you, kind sir. Uh, we would just need the parts. And then... Yeah, the rest of that stuff's easy peasy lemon squeezy. Well, there's probably a high probability... that he'll have the parts at some point. What time is it? Yeah. I don't know if we, we have enough time to get all the way out to Trader Jin. We definitely don't have enough time to get all the way out to her and then make it back to Bob. I am going to buy some of these thingies. Well, hmm. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and buy this. And I'm not going to Oh, my apologies. Well, Check back again and I may have what you're looking for. Can we buy an awesome sauce out of here? Yes, we can. It's 1500 though. It, it, the dirt bike chassis is not that expensive, so I think what we'll do is we'll take a sugar butts and we'll take a pumpkin cheesecake. 
but I'm not I'm not gonna consume the awesome sauce. I think I heard somewhere that it has to be over seven thousand coin to make it worth it to do an awesome sauce. Um, okay, so we're gonna buy this. And we could buy this, but eh, I don't know. 111.5 block damage. Problem is, we'll buy this and then we'll, we'll probably get one in a tier 4 <laughs> reward. But you know what? The money's coming in pretty good. I think I'm going to buy this too. We, we, maybe we should we should have taken this now. Um, Damn it. Damn it, Jim. Ah, uh, what the hell. Let's just do it. Okay. So we still have 12,000 12, coin there. Uh, all right, very good. So we just we'll just have to keep checking back here for dirt bike parts. Um, they all reset you tomorrow. Have a great day now. And we've got ourselves a nice impact driver. So let's take those off of there. Put them on here. And now the block damage is 131 compared to 58. Well, it's it. it, it it, if we're not counting the mods, it's basically it's got 53.2 more block damage. So that'll be nice for wrenching cars and stuff. And we got half of the motor, the dirt bike. So maybe uh, uh, Zulu Tango Foxtrot will not have to try and uh, talk HQ into sending us a dirt bike. We'll just make it on our own with the help from Bob. Okay, cool. All right, you guys. Well, that is it for this episode. So I'm going to head back to the base. Uh, we've got like over three full stacks of concrete. Uh, so I'll probably just wrench some more cars and stuff overnight. Uh, you know, just mostly for fuel. And then in the morning of day 28, we will um, we'll get the, the horde base put back together. Uh, we're going to do the same exact thing that we did before, except for instead of having a, having a single column supporting our little enclosure, we're gonna, I, I'm going to do like a big solid block. So that way there's uh, it's very unlikely then that they will take it down at that point. Uh, let's just go this way. This little trek through the wasteland here is not too bad because um, the forest is just right over there. Uh, but we do want to be careful not to run into anything because the vehicles in Alpha 21 take damage real easily. So with that being said, I'm going to let you guys go here. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And we'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.